The Bloody Hell Is is an insanely stylish and powerful weapon from the base game. It's a unique heavy thrusting sword that deals only physical damage and scales primarily from dexterity and arcane. It has a very strong passive bleed build up which makes it amazing to proc this status effect quickly despite of not being as fast as other weapons. My favorite feature of this blade is its unique skill Dyna's Finesse. It's one of the most cool looking movements you can perform and it has two follow ups. The first one helps to break the stance of your targets quickly while dealing a huge amount of stance damage and the second one will deal some additional damage proking bleed quite frequently. You can obtain this weapon very early, all you have to do is defeat the Sanguine Noble located in the right the Blood Rings in the Altus Plateau. This weapon is heavily underrated but it can be part of the PvE meta with no struggles cause it is extremely easy and fun to use. Therefore today I'll show you the best build possible for this amazing weapon and I'm going to use it to defeat every major boss of the base game and the DLC without taking a single hit. With this one we are going to use the Bloody Helis on plus 10, any seal we have available to cast or bring buffs, it doesn't need to be upgraded, we need any weapon with the Raptor Optimist of War to easily dodge their Dance Light Explosion attack and to start the fights with the Bleed buffs active we can use any weapon with Seppuku but it is completely optional. This time we are going to rock the Ansbach set that will increase our damage by a total of 15% if we wear the entire set but you can also use the White Mask, the problem of this is that the total damage you will obtain will be 16% so in my opinion I don't believe it's worth using this ugly mask for only 1% more damage. The best talismans we can use for this build are the Shard of Alexander Alexander, the Lord of Blood's Exultation, the Millicent's Prosthesis and the Rodent Wings or Insignia. But as this weapon deals a lot of stance damage, you can use the Blade of Mercy or the Dagger Talisman. In our Flask of Wondrous Physic, we are going to use the Blood Sucking Crack Tear and the Thorny Crack Tear. But you can also use the Stomach Crack Tear, this way you are going to deal a huge amount of stance damage and basically you are going to trivialize each boss fight. This weapon deals only physical damage, that's why our best body buff is going to be Blood Boil Aromatic. But if you don't like crafting, feel free to use Flame Grand Me Strength. And this weapon devours stamina so be sure to craft some pickle turtlenecks to boost your stamina regeneration speed. To get the most out of this weapon and to have an optimal build, we are going to use 50 on vigor, 21 on mind, 40 on endurance, only 16 on strength, 40 on dexterity, 25 on fate and 80 on arcane. Golden vow and flame grand me strength are going to be our main buffs. And to proc bleed faster we can use the swarm of flies. With the high level of arcane we have, this spell is going to be extremely useful. As you can see I have my scattership blessing on the level 20 and if you want to deal the max amount of damage possible to the hardest DLC bosses, be sure to have it on the level 20 as well. If you don't want to farm runes or materials for your Elden Ring builds, MMOEXP is the best web service where you can easily acquire as much runes and items as you wish for the best price. Use my code CARLOSEN to get a 5% discount on your purchases. Thanks MMOEXP for sponsoring today's video. Now I'll show you how to buff your character with this build. This one is pretty easy guys. First you have to use your Flask of Wondrous Physic, then you are going to cast Golden Vow and then you are going to eat your pickle torten leg which is completely optional. Then you will use your body buff, in this case it's blood boil aromatic but you can use flame grand strength. Now refill your FP, your HP and with that you should be ready to go. And if you want you can use seppuku to proc bleed on yourself and activate the lord of blood's exultation. But remember that this last step is completely optional. Now that we have completed and optimized our build, what do you say if we begin with the boss fight? Let's go, bro. Let's go. <laughs> okay, let's do this again, guys. Come on. Okay. Wow, bro. Let's go. What? I have an idea. Oh, look at my character. Oh, beautiful. Get down. Get out of here, bro. Wow. Okay, come on. Nice. Oh, that's some real damage, baby. Come on. Come on. Oh, goodbye, bad boy. 
We didn't even get the Blitzberg robot. It's okay, I guess. Oh, yeah, we did it. That's good. Let's go, baby. Good. Oh my gosh, what is this damage, bro? What is this damage? <laughs> Let's go, baby! <laughs> Amazing, bro. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, little guy. Oh my gosh. Take that. Too far? Are you kidding? Take this. <laughs> What is he doing? Oh! <laughs> Clean! <laughs> I'm going wild on you, Relana. Come on. Let's see what you can do. Take that, bad girl. You're a bad girl. Okay, careful here. Oh, 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 I'm going back for you, baby. Oh, let's go. <laughs> oh, I wake him up. Oh, that's nice. Okay, this attack is very good here to deal some stun damage. That's good. Come on. What? Oh, beautiful. Oh, take this. Oh, beautiful. No, you're not going anywhere, bad boy. <laughs> As you saw, I, oh, we, <laughs> we proc bleed, but at the very last moment, dude. <laughs> Careful. Nice. Now, give me four of these, please. Three. And four. Oh, this is not good. I, might, I will use another one. Just in case. That's very nice. Give me the crit hit. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Ah, let's go. We did it. <laughs> Beautiful, guys. Okay, little guy. I am here. Oof. That was a great start. Oh, beautiful, bro. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Oh! <laughs> this weapon is amazing, bro. <laughs> so we use this thing twice. It should be good. Let me take this. Okay. Oh, this is a lot better, baby. Come on. Give me that crit hit. Oh, it's over? Oh, no! <laughs> it's over, bro! <laughs> it's basically over, dude. Okay. Send some love to this guy. Oh, no. Oh, beautiful blade proc. Nice. Oh, beautiful, bro. Come on. This might be, guys. Oh, no way. Oh! <laughs> beautiful damage, bro. This was the good one. <laughs> okay, that's good. Okay. Come on. 
Okay, this tell me it's not fake. Maybe it's not, guys. Come on. Get down, bad boy. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh! <laughs> Beautiful! No way! What is this weapon, bro? <laughs> okay, this is so simple. You just do this and aim to your target. And he's done. Come on. That's amazing, bro. Let's go. Okay, come on. This is the good one, guys. What is going on? Ah, let's go, baby. Come on. Nice. <laughs> we use this one. That's good. Okay, that's nice. We use this one. Oh, beautiful, bro. Let's go. Come on, baby. Come on. Oh, let's go! We did it! <laughs> nice! This one was clean! <laughs> Take that. Let's go for it. Let's go, baby. Come on. Ah, stupid boss of.